In this video, I'm going to teach you how to connect Razer Barracuda X to PlayStation 5. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. The Razer Barracuda X or any other Barracuda models that you have will be compatible with your PlayStation 5. All that you have to do is plug it in using the provided USB-C wireless dongle. So when you unbox the Razer Barracuda X, one of the included accessories will be the wireless dongle. For you to connect it easily and the most convenient way to your PlayStation 5, you will have to use this Type-C wireless dongle. So all that you have to do is plug it into any of the available ports on your PlayStation 5. You can either do it directly to a Type-C port or you can use an adapter and plug it into the adapter so it can be plugged into a USB-A port, whatever you prefer. You only need to make sure that the actual wireless dongle gets detected. As soon as this is done, turn on the Razer Barracuda X and now it is going to connect to the dongle. Once it is connected, you will be able to use it directly on your PlayStation 5. To make sure that it is working, you can go over to the settings, choose the audio category, and when you go over to the devices, you will be able to choose it as an audio output device. Now, all of the audio coming through the PlayStation 5 will go over to the Razer Barracuda X. You will be able to use it wirelessly. If it doesn't work, you can try using a wireless connection, and this will also work natively, but you can do it wirelessly, so choose whichever one is more convenient for you. You don't have to spend time setting it up, and if it doesn't work right away, then what you can try to do is first make sure that it has sufficient battery. If you are using it wirelessly, you need to make sure that the Razer headset is charged, and if it still does not work, I recommend plugging it to a different USB port on the console, restarting it, and seeing if it appears under the audio devices. I hope I was able to help you on how to connect Razer Barracuda X to PlayStation 5. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.